And you know it's good, real good, like that good. Let's get into these egg rolls. We're gonna use Varela pasta today. This is my first time using these egg roll wraps. We're gonna get started with some smoked paprika, onion powder, garlic powder, some Old Bay seasoning, a little bit of jerk seasoning, and a little bit of Caribbean seasoning, and also cannot forget the Cajun Raging. And there it is, keepsake name after my grandma, Emily. Let's get started. Let's go ahead with a little bit of the sweet basil. Let's get started with the seasonings. I like to add a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of ginger paste. As you can see, I went on and added some fresh cilantro. I'm gonna go ahead and mix that all up. We're gonna set this in a refrigerator for about 30 minutes while we work on our pasta. Let's go ahead and add a little butter. Anyone that knows me know I love some fresh garlic. Now, I don't need the whole box, but I am gonna use about a half a box of the Barilla. I like to add a little oil just so it don't stick. We're gonna go ahead and add our salmon. So now all we're doing is stir frying the salmon. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of brown sugar. Okay, after about five minutes, be ready. We're gonna take our salmon and set it to the side. Now if you need to, just go ahead and mince this a little bit. But there you have it. Okay, so I used about a half a can of the fire roasted tomato. I drained off most of the juice. This is the pan that we made the salmon in. We're gonna go in with some more butter. And we can go ahead and add the tomato now. When I say bursting with flavor, that's what I mean. I'm adding some more fresh garlic. Cilantro is my favorite herb. We're gonna go ahead and add a little bit of fresh cilantro to the tomato. Okay, let's get that all blended together. Heavy cream. Let's say about a cup. A tablespoon of cream cheese. Let's go ahead and add about a tablespoon of sour cream. We're gonna go in and add a little bit of smoked paprika. We're gonna go ahead and add a little nutmeg. And let's go ahead and get this all blended well. Now we're gonna add a little bit of the pasta water. Just a little. We're gonna go ahead and add a little bit of the grated Parmesan cheese. We're gonna go ahead and add some sweet peppers. Let's go ahead and blend this together. Let's go ahead and add our fresh spinach. Now you don't want your filling to be that wet, but you do want to have a nice consistency like this. Let's go ahead and add some of that pasta. I know some of you are probably like, what is she doing? Don't worry. There is a method to my madness. We'll see. We're gonna go in with some Kraft mozzarella cheese right into the pasta, as much as you want, but not too much now. And I should say that cheese is just optional, but for the cheese lovers like myself, we going in, baby. Now I went on and grated some pepper jack cheese. A little bit of the filling there. You don't want to overstuff them. I like to add a little bit of the cheese here. Now we're going to go in with the salmon. 
These are going to be so good. Here it is, the jerk salmon pasta egg rolls. 